Let's discover the interface of Box Go 6 and let's see what you can do with it. First of all, this is like an Android tablet because it has um, Android 11. It has a custom interface here for you, but it has Google Play Store and you can install any app that you want. Of course, you, you cannot play games because it doesn't have the necessary hardware to, to offer those graphics, but any browser applic uh, application for reading or for text, for writing, you can do that. It has Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, you can know you can connect accessories, you can connect headphones via Bluetooth. So this is really amazing. First of all, you have the AI assistant here. This one will offer you um, all kind of support. It's basically like, like uh, chat uh, GB GPT. At this point, uh, you can uh, you can uh, you can type uh, anything here. For example, hi, and you can ask, uh, "Hello, how can I assist you today?" Um, you can uh, you can talk with uh, with it. It's an AI assistant. After that, you have uh, all kind of support for um, for synchronization. You have um, the calculator here available. You have um, uh, the calendar. You have the clock. alarm, uh, stopwatch, timer, just usual, usual um, uh, options from, from the Android. I have dictionary, I have this one installed from Google uh, Play Store. You have the gallery, you can have photos here. Um, you, you can listen any type of music here um, because you can also install uh, music, app, uh, music uh, apps from the Google Play Store. The Navi ball also it's really useful and you can customize the uh, this one and you can put any kind of button for it. Um, here it is. This is how you activate it and uh, you have basically uh, all these shortcuts available here on uh, on your device. You have the web browser, Google Play Store. You have a recorder. This device has a microphone, and it will let you to to record your own um, your own uh, voice uh, memos. Also, the screensaver. When you do la like this, you can take a, a screenshot. Here it is. So really, really um, cool interface with a lot of options. You have the possibility to um, uh, to sort the apps. So this is the app tab basically because you have five um, sh uh, five shortcuts here five icons you have the settings apps storage you have all your uh, files uh, classified you have store you can get um, free books from uh, from this one they have uh, they have some uh, classic books here and you can download them without problem and the library, this is where you will have your books if you don't use another app, for example. Here you have the possibility to create bookshelf, uh, to manage the library, to, to create uh, folders, to see them uh, in another format uh, or uh, like icons or um, uh, text. Um, it's up to you. You have the scan mode that will scan your micro SD card and it will offer you files here or you can choose to go with directory mode and you will have folders it's basically a file um, explorer it's really useful also if you um, if you do a swipe like this you have the shortcuts here you can customize all these shortcuts and you can put here whatever you want 
Look, you have even a screen recorder, you have hotspot, do not disturb. You have screencast, mirror cast, you can connect this one to, to anything that you want uh, that has a mirror cast support, like a TV or laptop or tablet. You can um, record the screen, as I said. So this is it uh, in settings here. If you go, you will have um, language, uh, date and time, power, networks. You can set a password for this device. You have the gestures. So um, this device, it's really, really powerful and very, um, very interesting. It's a complex device. And to say it, um, to say it in this way, again, this is basically a tablet with Android that offers you all these features. If you press and hold on a book, you will see all these details like this and you can manage um, this book, for example, what to do with it, to delete, set a custom cover, to rename it. You can move it in another folder, you can lock it, you can, you can send it uh, to, um, to cloud or you can share it like on Android. Uh, if you press the share button, look, it will, uh, it will offer you the possibility to, to press quick share or Bluetooth via Bluetooth to another device. Really amazing um, this aspect. You can open it with some other apps. Here it is. I have these two reader readers at this point. This is really really nice. So this is uh, the main interface, and in general, general, this is what you can expect from this device to to see on it, and so much more other settings in in anything that you use here.